So, I guess we go to the chapel. Talk to the rabbis. To ram the stick in your mouth. Oh, hello, everyone. Yeah, 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 yeah. We don't care about your backstory. Request, please. I'll need a number of items in order to make it. All right. Accept the request. What do you need? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Pretzels. What do you need? I don't know how to make pretzels, so I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me the ingredients, please. What did you, what did she say? Fuck. What did she say? What did she say? Five hearty powder. Five clear gelatin. Some white seed. You want some of this white seed? You want my white seed? Do you? Young sister? I'll get you some white seed. If you know what I mean. Let's get let's get her that white seed that she wants. We can get the first two from monsters, but we'll need to get the third from the Arsade household head chef. Alright, let's go to the Arsade household head chef. I'm sure that let me let me let me guess. The Arsade school's head chef or Arsade family's head chef is uh a man, right? Because of course, because of course it is. And we'll get we'll get his white seed. Can we get some white seed, please? Would you have some white seed on your person? Damn, he has an entire crate full of his white seed. You definitely received your white seed. There's no way that they didn't know what they were doing, right? There's no way. So, what do we actually need? Let's see. Ingredients. Uh... I guess... Clear... We have enough. We have literally everything, right? Hearty powder and gelatin. We have loads of those. Here's the white sea you wanted. The chef's white seed, yes. I'm sure you'll enjoy that white seed. Oh yeah, we enjoyed the taste of that white seed in that pretzel. Yes. Tasty and filling, if you know what I mean. I'm sure you were engrossed in the taste of the pretzel with the white seed in it. All right, we get some Legram pretzels filled with filled with white seed in it. So, we're going to go offer it somewhere. Ah, all right. Let us offer these white seed pretzels. Let's get on praying. <laughs> ah, ha, ha. I was focusing so hard on being quiet, I ended up holding my breath. It was a valiant battle to remain silent for even a single minute, but alas, victory remained elusive. Right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Celestial bombs, eh? Nice. Three of them. That's actually a good reward for once. For once, we got a good reward out of a side quest. Most of the time, we just get fresh eggs and strawberries and white seed like stuff. But this time, actually, we got some celestial bombs. Which is good. Oh, all of the fog on the highway has dissipated as well. It's so much easier to see the sur all the surrounding areas now. All right. 
Now, personally, if we're talking about Emma's, you know, secret, I'm not, I'm, I've never been a fan of people keeping secrets and like, quote unquote, watching over someone, someone special. It's like the whole, like, it's like the whole Obi-Wan looking over, uh, watching over Luke thing. My turn. Here we go. Oh, fuck off. What the fuck? What the? What the? What the? F what the fuck? Yes, sir. It's like the whole Obi-Wan looking oh, over Luke answer. thing. Right. But it's like and then and then usually these types of characters they never actually tell the 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 person in question like all the information. I'm a very big hypocrite when it comes to the stuff like this because I'm I'm usually the type of person who keeps the secrets, but uh, I hate having people keep secrets from me, especially when it has to do with me. Right? I don't I don't mind if someone keeps a secret that has nothing to do with me, but if it has everything to do with me, then I fucking hate it when someone keeps val like very important information from me. I hate that shit. Arcus, activate. Oh, I can activate. So in this case, as as we are, Reen, in a way, I kind of really don't like the fact that Emma and Celine have some sort of big secret that they're keeping from Reen, and Reen is clearly involved. And because, you know, they're kind of, they're like the Obi-Wan to our Luke. Yggdrasil. Here we go. Arcus, activate. No. Go, Laura. I mean, Emma, fuck. I keep saying Laura for her. God, that's so good. <laughs> Let's keep going. Triple kill. Not bad. Oh, yes, we've already uh, looted all these chests. Have we been? I don't think we've been in the second highway, right? Or have we? I think we have, actually. Where I think we haven't been is... We can't... Yeah, yeah, yeah. There! Hey! Noise, noise, noise. All right. Oh, it's so cool here, you'd hardly believe it's summer. The weather's pleasant today. A fine wind blowing too. Oh my god, Gaius just cannot stop talking about the wind, can he? Every, yeah. every time Gaius yeah. speaks, it's like, ooh, there's... The yeah, wind is, is, is blowing. Here we go. Yes. Oh yeah, fuck. Uh... Arcus. I'm gonna impassion Laura. I want to see her her new version, her new her, her new version of of the S craft. We haven't seen that yet. The area is a lot larger. No, it's still the Radiant Blade Dance. Okay, maybe it's a little more purple now. And it's stronger. Still have a lot of training to do. So the area... The animation is basically the same, just... I think it's there's a little bit more, like, pink slash purple added in. 
to the to the to the blue. And then it's stronger and the area effect is is larger. I mean, okay. Yeah, I mean, I I kind of hoped for something extra, but like it is what it is, you know, like can't always get what you want. Of course. Hey. I would have said that if 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 we got like a new animation then it would have been really cool, but um Yes sir It's my turn Yeah My turn huh? My turn Go Now's our chance An opening You're finished yeah. Indeed they are We should keep going. Indeed. And now, the boss is not gonna stand a chance. Shining. The boss is literally not gonna stand a chance. It is a machine. Hmm. This thing looks like some sort of Futuristic, fu futuristic, mesh, like, robot turret, turret robot. All right. Just don't die in one hit, hey? There's no way, there's no way this thing survives all three of their S-breaks, right? Or S-crafts. There's no way. Go. Behold the might of the Arcade School. Radiant Blade Death. Yep. You still have a lot of training to do. <laughs> I did it. I feel like I'm going strong. Just getting started. <laughs> a matter of course. Is it dead? Hmm. I don't think this thing's any relation of Lambie's. For one thing, it looks like it's made out of, out of metal. That's true. Aragetlum and the combat shells we use in our practical exams seem to be made of, out of some other substance. While they may be inorganic, the combat shells do have a certain kind of warmth. Hmm. That's suspicious. Like a infiltration robot of some sort? Perhaps. Okay, no more chests over there. I guess we just head back. I guess we'll go the other way back. Now we now we just need Reen to increase his S craft. Cause his 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 area of effect is is still so fucking small. Your swordsmanship gets better with every battle. I've got a week. Also I also wonder if like, if or when we're going to be able to use Reen's, like, Super Saiyan ability, like, on, on, on purpose. Such great teamwork. Just EP charge. We'll also take down this big, big oh, ass wow, dude. There's a river out here. Oh wow, there's a river out here. I remember playing in this river when I was young. A challenging foe. We should engage it with care. There! There! A worthy adversary. My turn. 
Is it though? Is it though? Yeah, that's what I thought. Instant kill. KO. Do we have anything? Like a chest behind this? Ooh. Shit. Dark matter. Arcus, activate. Yeah. Igdrasil. Arcus, activate. Of course. Arcus. Arcus, activate. activate. Right back at you. Well, they're probably dead, right? Crystal Flood. Oh yeah, I never tried this actually. But I think they're dead before we can even do that, so... Lol. I think they're dead. Or not. They were stronger than I realized. Here we go. Check. Go. An opening. My turn. Not really. Gather on, my blade. Gather on his blade. The eight leaves. <laughs> oh, a treasure chest. Two, actually. Ooh, Zepeth. Ooh, Dawn Boots. It's my turn. Uh, right. We actually, I believe we got... We got some new boots, right? Ooh, we did. Oh my god, we did. We'll give we'll give these Stragas to uh, to Laura, and then maybe ooh we'll give Lady Stragas to Milliam, and then we'll give her the Dawn Boots, I think. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. My turn. Indeed it is. Say <laughs> We have the advantage. My turn. Come on, Lammy. Skip. <laughs> Don't mess with us. Uh-huh. Alrighty. Anything back here? Oh my god, there is. Ooh, that one looks tough. There! There! <laughs> I don't think we can knock him off guard. Watch yeah. Out. This is a tough one. Gleaming blade. Soul is a revealing light. This is it! Gotcha! My turn. Ta Evil will fall before my blade. Oh my god, it will. Indeed, it will. Mm -mm. Nothing much, but we get XP and... Uh, uh, might as well, might as well. We get XP and potential items. Yeah, 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 yeah. No point in, no point in wasting time. Okay, it's safe for now. Just, just Get through it immediately. Hiya! I mean, hiya! All right. We are done. We should be able. To, we should get another task, I, I guess, from Tovel in the afternoon. Hmm? Something seems amiss here. The town isn't usually this noisy. I don't hear anything.
Looks like there's a liner back at the harbor. But who are those weird people around it? This is some, uh, imperial military looking shit. They look like soldiers from one of the provincial armies. White and purple. I seem to remember seeing those colors back in Heimdall. I believe that combination of colors represents the Lamar provincial army. What business could they could their provincial army have in Legram? Tobol? Oh my god, it is. Apparently, some big shot noble is visiting the Viscount as we speak. Another noble visiting Fata. Who could possibly? That's concerning. Mm -hmm. Well, if you're curious, why why don't you go take a look for yourselves? Since you returned from the highway, that means you took care of the monster, right? The the group gave a brief description of the monster they fought to Tovel. A mechanical monster, you say? Hmm. Hmm. Tovel, you have any, you have some ideas as to what it might be? Well, I'm not sure, but I think I'll go have a look at what's left of it, just in case. Anyway, good work out there, guys. Here's, here is your reward. Seven U material. Nice. I can, I can use that. He definitely seems like he knows something we don't. Probably. Probably indeed. Well, for now, there's no harm in leaving the matter to him. Right, we should see what's going on at Laura's house. Indeed we should. Just running around another lord's territory. How pompous can you get? It sounds like there's a real VIP here. Well, let's return to the manor for now. Indeed we shall. But first we save. Oh? Isn't that... Who is that? Extravagantly addressed man. There's no need to be so hasty. At least give my proposal some thought. Your attendance would add an extra degree of prestige to our gathering. I'm merely the lord of a minor rural, rural region. Surely you overstate the importance of my presence. A man's worth is decided not by himself, but by those he rubs elbows with. And while I'm sure you understand, I'd appreciate it if you didn't do anything to cause any unnecessary conflict. I'm not sure giving combat training to the Imperial Army is something you ought to be doing either. After all, neither of us want any trouble now, do we? I. Ha ha. And with that, I bid you a fond farewell. Oh, and my, my compliments on the excellent tea. I am honored, Your Grace. See ya. Excuse us. We'll definitely be fighting those guys in the near future, most likely. There's no way they would have bodyguards that are that detailed looking. Otherwise, my, if it isn't young Laura. And Jesus Alborea too. It's a pleasure to see you again, Your Grace. I wasn't expecting him to show up here, of all people. That's Duke Cayenne, head of the foremost of the four great houses and ruler of uh, the port city of Ordis. His authority extends over the entire province of Lamar to the, to the west. Duke Cayenne. Cayenne. I'd love to stay and talk a while, but I'm afraid other urgent matters call me away. I'll endeavor to arrange another opportunity for us to meet in the new future. But for now, I bid you farewell. Indeed he does. Oh, what are we here? So you're a Thor's Military Academy's Class 7, eh? How do you... Oh, just happened to do a little leisure time reading on your class. 
Not a bad looking bunch. Good, good. See ya, kids. Who are those men? They don't look like soldiers from a French provincial army, that's for sure. They knew about a class. I presume they're personal bodyguards hired by Duke Cayenne. Cayenne. Father. Ha ha. You needn't look so concerned. However, it seems like they've finally begun to act. Who's they? The noble faction has begun acting in secret? Indeed, for the past month they've been quite active behind closed doors. No doubt they're uh, trying to reaffirm their unity, holding conference after conference all across the country. Of course, I'm sure this is news to your youngest classmate. Well, yeah. The intelligence division uh, is all on edge, wondering whether they're about to start a full-scale conflict with the reformists. So that's what they've been up to scurrying around all this time. But since Duke Cayenne's basically the leader of the noble faction, I sure wasn't expecting him to come all the way out here in person. Nor was I. They appear to be planning a large conference in the near future, be uh, attended by all the members of the noble faction. But Duke came all the way out here to insist that I attend. But, father, you're not even a member. Quite right. I mean, quite right, my lady. Your father has long kept his distance from the faction. In the same way, he has also kept space between himself and the reformists, preferring to remain neutral. However, they, they're convinced that all nobles should belong to the noble faction as a matter of course. I've heard they've been quite forceful about bringing those nobles who don't support the faction into their ranks. Hmm. There's been some disagreement over whether Duke Cayenne or Duke Alberea should lead the four great houses, but I expect that either would bring the same platform to the table. Jesus. If you don't mind my if you don't mind my asking, do you happen to know where my family stands on the issue? Ha ha, you need to, you need not worry about your family's allegiances. Lord Schwarzer is widely known as an even more obstinate man than I. I can't imagine that he'd have any interest in supporting the questionable actions of the other nobles. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Perhaps there is a move we can make after all. I'm afraid I'll be leaving Legram Le again on another of my little trips. I apologize for the suddenness, but please tend to things in my absence. As you wish, my lord. Well, that was sudden. I intend to establish contact with all the nobles who have remained neutral in the ongoing factional conflict, so as to prevent them from being taken in by the noble faction's coercive methods. In that case, I'd be happy to come with you. Weren't you going, like, to the, the, the forest to check out the machine? Rufus was here as well, eh? Wait, Kayan. 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 With a C, Comrade G, or Comrade C. It's Comrade C. Oh my God, it is. So that's another suspicious person. We have to. We have to. For now, we'll assume that Kn is Comrade C.
We've got confirmation that a mechanical monster appeared on the highway outside Legram. Is that so? Hmm. I believe this is the first time one's appeared since the counteroffensive Sir Cassius launched, launched two years ago. Sir Cassius? Who's Sir Cassius? Another C. Another comrade C, maybe. Cassius. 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 There, there was some sort of thing that happened two years ago, apparently. So, a character that maybe was involved with that and now has, you know... A beef with um, some other guy, maybe a chancellor of some sort, that starts with the name uh, with, with the letter C. You know, the name the name starts with a C. Cassius. Hmm. 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 Who knows? Who knows? It sounds like there's a lot more going on here than just factions butting heads. The Legend of Heroes, Trails of Cold Steel. Alright, here's what I got for you this afternoon. A Golden Catch. Client, Weiber. Or Weber. Calling all fishermen. Could someone catch me the, the elusive gold salmon? Salmon. Find me at the Epicos Inn for more detailed information. Very well. In fact, I hope all of you will look past her uncouth father and continue giving her your friendship and support. Indeed we will. We shall, in fact, do so, Viscount Arsaid. As a single father, the fact that I've yet to hear any tales of budding romance concerning my daughter has me worried. Father? He, <laughs> it would be our pleasure. Hmm. There they go. Moving on, Toval has entrusted us with looking after the guild. We may only have half a day remaining, but still have a duty to fulfill. Indeed, let's go fulfill our duty. So what was it? I kind of forgot already. Right. God damn it. Fucking fishing. I thought I could get away with never fishing in this game. I did actually click on it. Uh, click on fishing. I think I fished like one fish, but I, I cut that out in, in, I think, the episode before this one, actually. Or actually, no. Two episodes ago. Who knows? Yeah, 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 yeah. Gold salmon. Gold salmon. Yeah, 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 yeah. In a river along the highway several times. Well, we'll probably see it on the map. The Lux Rod. Okay, I guess we're going to the highway. Oh, look who it is. There's a woman, Annabelle.
That shiny golden glow. I simply can't wait to catch it. Excuse me, could we talk to you for a moment? Who are you? Wait, I recognize you. You are that you're you're that military academy student who saved me in my hour of need several months ago. Oh yeah, I think we did meet her once before. Is the is this the one that lost her uh, her wallet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm surprised I remember that honestly. Sadly, my wallet has become rather lighter since you returned it to me. I'm trying to catch my dinner, of course. Let us compete to see who can catch the gold salmon first. Dude, I, I don't know how to compete. What the fuck? I'm just gonna save just in case so we don't fail this somehow. I don't know. I, I don't remember how to fish. Uh, change rod. Deluxe rod. Instructions. Oh yeah, you have to like... Spam the button. Okay. Should be fine. I don't think it's possible. Legitimately, I, I can't press the button any faster. Huh. Well, maybe I can. I have to use uh, my, my other thing. I have to use... Oh my god. Ah, my 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 fucking hand started cramping. Ah, oh, okay, we caught it. Thank god. My fucking hand started cramping. I had to use my my secret technique of my hand vibration, the finger vibration. I have this ability to vibrate my my entire hand. It's a secret ability. Impossible. Bakuna. You caught a gold salmon before me? How can this be happening? All right, we're heading. Let's head back. <laughs> Yo, you wanted the gold salmon? I guess we're eating gold salmon today, boys and girls. And so it was that with forks held high, they all dug in and enjoyed the fruits of their labor. Indeed they did. Dude, I'ma be honest, that's kinda weird though. If if you had six people, like I think the table is large enough for everyone to be eating at the same table. Just bring the chairs over. I'm sure it tastes great, but we don't really care now, do we? Fresh herbs. Tomatoes. Some shells. Great. Complete ass trash rewards. Could have could have could have could have given us some, I don't know, money. You know, some 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 fresh mira. We shall return to the guild. We have nothing else. Nothing else to, to do here now. 
Thus, the members of Group A brought their fruitful day of work to an end. And following the instructions Tobel left for them, they began the not-quite-as-exciting process of filing the paperwork. Oh, are you finished? Yeah, we just finished getting everything sorted out. Goodness, that was exhausting. Well, someone's sleeping. Is something the matter? Nah, I was just thinking. If bracers play an essential role to the people of other countries, are they not just as essential to Erebonians? Well, you may be right. Not just because they help maintain bub public order and provide other services. That ideal of prioritizing the protection of civilians above all else is pretty noble. It's something people admire. That is certainly true. In many ways, it's the form of nobility that's beginning to fall by the wayside within Erebonians aristocracy. I'm not sure the issue is as black and white as, you, as you'd have it. The guild is an organization first and foremost, and one based far too much on idealism, far too little on practicality. Donations of public funding can only go so far in covering its operation costs. It's no stretch at all to say that with the Empire as, as it is now, the guild's removal was inevitable. That's why my brother said once, uh, that's what my brother said once, when we discussed this. Jesus. Emma, they're so big. And soft. Anyway. Excuse me! I mean, excuse me, is anyone here? Is Tovel here by any chance? I'm afraid he's out. They haven't come home. Julian and Corno still haven't come back home from the castle. Ah, uh, I get it. Let me guess. This is uh, what Celine thought up. Wait, you don't mean... Yeah. Right, they needed, uh... Celine and Laura needed the group to go to the castle, right? This is probably their lure. Sounds like a serious problem. I'll have Klaus prepare us a boat at once. The group, the group searched the town from top to bottom, but they found no sign of the missing children. By the time the other residents became aware of what was happening, evening had given way to night. Indeed it had. Well, I think it's safe to say the boys aren't in town. Looks like they really did head out toward the castle in a boat. The lake's been calm and there's no sign of a boat on the water, so at least it's unlikely they capsized. At this point, all we can do is venture into the castle and see what we find. We have to use the boat now, do we not? We do. A couple of students from the Arsate School are preparing an oval boat for us as we speak. It does worry me that it had started to grow misty again, though. Hmm. Very well. I guess we're off in search of... children. Ugh. Of course it has to be children. Why can't it just be a group of pretty young ladies? You know? It can never be a group of pretty young ladies. 
It's always a bunch of little boys, children, fucking annoyances. God. I see the orbital boat has been repaired. Yes. All right. The part. Let us go and rescue people in distress. What do you think is waiting for us inside the castle? You know this isn't a game, right? I know, I know. But as long as Lammy's with us, there's nothing to worry about. Let's just grab those kids so we can go exploring. Ding dong, ding dong. Ding dong, ding dong. Yeah, Emma's like, mmm. A bell tolling at night in the old stronghold of the Eisenritter. It best be prepared for anything. We're almost there. Let's make sure we're prepared before we head ashore. Ashore. Well, here we are. There's another boat here. I I honestly think the the children is just a fake. Honestly, there's no children. I don't think I think it's Celine luring them here. And I think the children was just some story that they had this girl make up. So this is St. Sandlot's old stronghold, Lohengrin Castle. Indeed it is. This is the first time I've come here at night. Be careful of your footing. Something strange about the castle. It's like Is lit that up. Blue, just the moonlight. There's some sus things going on here. Something. Things may not be as they seem. There's like a force field around the castle. This reminds me of, um... That one location in... Lord, so of, the, Lord, of, Lord of the Rings, you know? One of them evil places? I don't know what it, I don't know what it, what it's called. I'm not a big Lord of the Rings fan, but... It reminds me of that. The ancient stronghold of Saint Sandlot. Gathering place of the warriors of old. It looks even more beautiful up close. Yeah, but what's up with that weird glow? I've been here several times before, but I've never seen it like this. I can sense a very strange wind blowing from within. Literally, Gaius, there, I, has there been a single sentence that Gaius has said? Like, just, just one of them mentions. You know, like when, when the group is talking about something and then every character kind of says something? Has there been a single time when Gaius actually doesn't say something about the wind, or doesn't mention the wind. I think at least the last three sentences that Gaius has said, he's mentioned the wind. It doesn't feel like monsters, though. The wind feels off. The wind definitely tells me that it's that way. The wind is definitely giving me a blowjob right now. Jesus Christ, dude. Hmm? Enough, enough about the wind. I feel it too, like something is writhing around inside. Wait, what kind of something? I feared as much. I can definitely sense the presence of the dead. Emma? I'm alright, but we're going to need to tread carefully in there. Right. There's no telling what may happen when we venture inside. I'm feeling that we Emma's gonna... Before entering. We're gonna get Emma's S-Craft in the new future now. 
There's something very strange happening here. Let's make sure we're ready for whatever we may find inside. Yes, why wouldn't we enter? They really want us to prepare. Interesting. Jesus, calm down. It won't budge. Did the well, door just we'll, we're locked in. Seal itself shut on its own. You, you stupid door! Lammy, bust it open! Yeah, even I, I don't think it's strong enough for that. Ooh, magically, but magically sealed. Well, that was unexpected. No. So not even Air Gantlum can break us out of here. It appears that there's a barrier in place. What kind of barrier? Are you talking about that strange symbol that appeared on the door for him? How would you know something like that, Emma? Indeed, how do you know so much? Huh, Emma? Well, I've always had a pretty strong sixth sense about these kinds of things. So sometimes sure I can you sense have. things that aren't visible to the naked eye. A uh, sixth sense? Hm. Fascinating. Come to think of it. This isn't the first time you've reacted strangely to unusual phenomena. Eustace has a point. I've heard that people from the church can make use of some strange powers. So are you a sister of the church or something? Uh, I'm kind of the opposite. Oh, uh, you got me! I've always been a big supporter of the church! The opposite? What would be the opposite of a supporter of a church? Supporter of the devil? I don't know. The, honestly, I'm Emma, not Emma's sure what you're getting at. Emma's secret is like honestly something I cannot predict. Maybe, maybe once it's revealed, I'll be like, ah, oh, yeah, I can see that. But right now, I just, I, I really can't, I can't tell what, Emma, what, what just, the secret is. Who are you? Exactly. Ah! What's that sound? It's the bell we heard earlier. Something's approaching to the left and the right. All right, some sort of apparition. These monsters, is it? No, these are no ordinary beasts. But we're going to have to fight them all the same. Here they come! Be careful, everyone. My turn. Let me guess. They 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 have some. Okay, maybe not. Okay, they they don't like water. Can we attack them physic with physical attacks? We can. They're kind of weak. It's my turn. Yeah. Right back at ya. Yeah, you didn't stand a chance. They were kind of weak. Looks like we beat them. <laughs> Are you all right, Milliam? Oh shit. Let me guess. We're gonna have to take Milliam out of the party, right? <laughs> Mysterious spirits. Though perhaps it would be more appropriate to call them fiends. Either way, they were no ordinary opponents. The higher elements seem to be present here as well, and I suspect that's true of the whole castle. Yeah, it did feel that way, though I'm still not sure what the ringing bell from earlier has to do with anything. <sighs> this place seems to be even more dangerous than we could have anticipated, and as long as that barrier remains in place, so will we. We're going to need to search for a way out. Okay, Emma. Looks like we're going to need to rely on this sixth sense of yours in order to navigate this castle safely. You don't have to tell us anything if you're not comfortable. Right now, our safety is in your hands. Can we count on you? Okay, I like that. I like that, you know, they, they, they're they kind of catching on that there's clearly something that Emma isn't being truthful about. And they're just saying, hey, you know, you don't have to tell us if you don't want to, but at least, you know... We hope we hope that we can rely on you for help. Yes, of course. All right, then time is of the essence. That's how that's how you should always do things. If there's something obvious that people don't want to tell, then it's like, hey, you don't have to tell us, but at least tell us what we need to know. Keep us on a need-to-know basis. Seems like those roaming the castle. I'm even more worried about the children. True. We should start looking right away. We're going already. Can't we rest here a little longer? Nah, mate. <laughs> the 
those fiends scare the strength right out of your legs? No! That's totally not it! Did you piss your pants or something? Maybe shouldn't come? You're more than welcome to stay here and wait. Whoa, waiting by myself would be even worse! <laughs> Alright, let's see what we can find. Right. I knew it. Emma can now use the S-Craft Lord Alberion. Interesting. Very, very interesting. I'm just gonna say, just in case. Alright, we get some monsters all, all around here. Hmm, that's not working. That, that works every time. Here we go. Let's go. She builds a damn castle. Lord damn. Rest in peace. She even says the thing. Oh my Let's god. Keep going. She says the rest in peace thing. Rip in pieces, as they say. I've only just getting started. That should suffice. She's probably she she is probably part of the Brotherhood. There! There! She's part of the Assassin's Creed. She follows the Assassin's Creed, probably. We have probably trained by Ezio himself. Uh I mean we don't need to rest right now. Let's just go up. There! We have the advantage. Triple advantage, that is. Yeah, yeah, gather on his blade. Don't need to see this. They're just dead. Okay, maybe they're not. My turn. Huh. Hey. Yes, sir. Hey. It's my turn. Here. My turn. Hey. You still have These guys are just so easy that they go down instantly. Hmm. Guess we'll go this way to the barrier first. A barrier seals the way. Doesn't look like we can pass through. We'll need to find some way to open it. I guess we'll go the other we way. We need a key to dispel a barrier like this. We should start looking. Alright. Key it is, then. There! New material. Battle scope. There! Lohengrin Castle, left wing. Going down. I welcome all yeah. 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 Go. Take. Take. We'll cut our own path. Indeed we will. These monsters are pretty yeah. weak. This castle has no yeah. shortage of strange foes. Perhaps they really are go. D don't say it. Perhaps they really, really are ghosts, indeed. Now's our chance. But if they were ghosts, Go. we would not be able to touch them with our physical attacks, most likely. Yeah, you didn't stand a chance. I feel like I'm going strong. Skip. Hmm. Ooh. Is that a key? There's some sort of orb s sitting on it. Is this what we're looking for? Indeed. I suspect this orb will disable the barrier and the door to the castle's east wing. Yellow orb. There's something I'm curious about. Ooh, this door looks like, uh, very simmer, similar to the red door, right? Yep. Emma's still going, mm. We should check it, just in case. 
It doesn't seem like it wants to open. Even the patterns on it are like the ones on the door in the old schoolhouse. Odd as it may seem, maybe they are connected somehow. We did theorize that the old schoolhouse may be connected to the Emperor, to Emperor Dreykels in some way. Saint Sandlot was Dreykels, Dreykels' foremost ally and on close terms with him even before he became Emperor. There might be connections. I suppose we'll, uh... We'll go to the door. Is that a treasure chest? Luna rope. What be this? ADF. ATS defense. Still don't remember what ADF did. I think we should give this to... Her. Yeah. Ooh, I did not see that. Seems they like hiding chests in, in little, little corners. 